welcome to Pefka, home of the Minotaur, and our world-famous Minotaur tunics. Tunics! Minotaur tunics! One size fits all. I don't see how one size can fit everyone. My name's Arsenios. If you want to know how to defeat the Minotaur and become the Greek world's most famous warrior, then this is the tour for you. You sell it well, kid. Let's go on your tour. Uh, you're not worried someone's going to steal your world-famous Minotaur tunics? Who would? They're tunics for Minotaurs. As you can see from the statues, the Minotaur's a fearsome foe. So don't forget this exclusive tour, team. And that he hates to be stabbed, particularly the sharp objects. They say it's his only weakness. Behold, an exact replica of the Minotaur. Actual Minotaur size may vary. Where's the rest of him? Up the hill. Some of the workers lost control moving it into place. It killed two of them. Horn stored them clean apart. Well, not clean apart. Sounds like even Minotaur statues are deadly. Oh, they're the deadliest. They say the sales himself was killed by a Minotaur statue. I've heard many tales of the Minotaur. They usually make the Seos sound more heroic. Well, Sparta's not known for its quality education, is it? Next thing you tell me, Medusa's real? Uh, let's just continue the tour. Hey, in Pefka, the hero's always right. This way. Look out! That rock's actually a Minotaur dropping. He must have just that been through more. here. I no, can't believe we missed him. Here's another helpful tip you won't get on any other tour. A the Minotaur Zeus isn't the morning person. Trust me, I know my they Minotaurs. Sure like I've been in this business 27 years. Just between you and me. I'm kinda hoping my boy Arsenios Jr. takes over someday. Good kid. Good kid. Warriors from all over the Aegean come to Pefka to face the mighty Minotaur, hoping to claim his head as the ultimate prize. So far, well... <clears throat> he's killed all of them, but drinking freshly squeezed Minotaur hoof elixir will no doubt give you the oomph you need to triumph. Where does this Minotaur hoof elixir come from? The hoof of the Minotaur, obviously. It's right there in the name. Uh-huh. What does this elixir do? Besides, give me oomph. Depends what ails you, friend. Sore throat? Slow healing ones? Itchy beats on parts unmentionable. Will it cure the regret of taking unnecessary tours? Yes. And let me guess. You've got a vial. Ready for purchase. It's just like Petter always said. Never leave home without the ground-up hooves of a mythical creature. You never know when you'll need some... Minotaur hoof elixir. You've made a wise purchase, my physically responsible friend. Now come. There's so much more to see. I'm not saying I'm responsible for breaking the Minotaur statue, but I'm also not saying I'm not responsible. And so concludes our tour. That's the tour? I didn't learn anything about the Minotaur. My customers are always satisfied. You can pay my associates on your way out. Please enjoy the rest of your stay here in Pefka. Good scum, kid. If I was as ambitious as you when I was your age, my life would have turned out much better. Possibly making bad wine on an island somewhere. Thank you. Until next time, warrior. Oh, no, 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 no. Absolutely not. Ah, a mighty specimen approaches. Are you ready for honor? For glory? For certain death? I'm ready for two-thirds of that. Then you seek combat with... The Minotaur! No self-respecting Minotaur would live in Lato. He does. Here? Yes. In Lato? Yes! This Lato? I assure you, the beast lives here. 
and he wants nothing more than a wealthy, a uh, worthy opponent to battle. If you slay the Minotaur, you would be Theseus reborn, and you'd get to take home the prize of Pefka! Your Minotaur must die. Sounds like we have another contender! It's time for the trials of the Minotaur! Three trials. Did you just say Minotaur three trials? To face the Minotaur, you must first prove yourself worthy by completing three heroic trials. We can't let people fresh off their Teremis casually stroll to their deaths. Pefka policy. What do these pre-trials require me to do exactly? There's the trial of strength, where you fight the greatest warrior in all of Crete. The trial of accuracy, which only a keen eye can overcome. And the trial of endurance, where you must brave the water. One of your trials is swimming? That's... Uh, this is a scheme to fleece me. <gasps> Mystios! I... that's... How could you even think such a thing? You're a terrible person. What exactly is the prize of Pefka? Why, it's limitless riches, of course. Warriors defeated by the Minotaur no longer need their drachmi. So we collect their coins into a grand prize that only a champion who kills the beast may claim. Your grand prize is drachmi looted from the dead? Mystios, please believe me. Many of the coins go straight to the Lato school for children whose parents were tragically killed by the Minotaur. I see. I'll do your trials. Pre-trials! I'll do your pre-trials. But then the Minotaur's head is mine. Fantastic! Don't forget to collect tokens of success from the trial masters to prove your victories. Ugh, another some people here to save us all from Pefka's long queues and overpriced Minotaur merchandise. Ah, may I introduce my wife, Cory, a rare beauty and so... so loud in front of my new friend. <laughs> Please, Leandros, there are more important things than glory. Nothing stands in the way of glory. Statues aren't carved to honor the insignificant. And what about my daughter? Is he insignificant, hero? Your daughter? Amara. She ran off days ago. I'm sure she's... she's just fine. Don't worry about Amara. Not when there's a Minotaur to slay. Grrr! Slash! Slash! Big fight! Lots of blood! Think of the fame, Mystios. Think of winning the prize of Pefka! Please, trust me, Siapio. Nothing is what it seems in Pefka. Solving one problem may just solve all the others. Go, my legendary friend. The pre-trials of the Minotaur await. Here, a poorly muscled challenger. You are here to have your feeble frame crushed in my pre-trial of strength, yes? My feeble frame might be harder to crush than you think. <laughs> so brave, pretending you have a chance against a warrior as strong and handsome as me. We may fight for my token, yes. But maybe you would prefer to remain uncrushed and buy my token instead, yes? No. We fight. Are you sure you would not prefer to spend your shiny drachmi? We fight. Then let the crushing begin. What... what am I feeling? What is this? The shame of defeat. This is defeat? Winning is better. Yes, the token of strength is yours. Have a wonderful day and please don't hit me again. I warn you, pay to pass this trial, potential champion. The trial of endurance has seen more deaths than all the other trials combined. Were others drunk when they jumped? Actually, yes. Very unprofessional of them. Should you survive the champion's dive, you'll need to retrieve my trial token from a chest in the darkest depths of the water below. Your token will be mine. No, please, I urge you, pay me for my token. The watery dangers you must otherwise face to retrieve it are too great. You won't get one drag me from me. I'll do the trial. 
Uh, if an excruciating underwater death is what you desire, who am I to stop you? Remember, you'll find my token in a chest at the bottom of the lake. I'll be waiting for you at the water's edge in the extremely unlikely event you survive. How exactly does going for a swim test my ability to slay the Minotaur? Minotaurs work in mysterious ways. What trouble have they gotten into now? Their mother's going to feed into that damned Minotaur. This must be the pre-trial of accuracy. Hmm? Oh, yes. This is the pre-trial of accurately finding my Malakis sons. Your sons? This doesn't sound like a trial. Have you tried raising sons? It's perhaps the greatest trial of all. Only by completing the world famous and totally legitimate pre-trial of accurately finding my sons can you proceed and face the Minotaur. So, if I find your sons and make sure they're safe, you'll give me your trial token? You'll get my token and my eternal gratitude. <sighs> I'll find your sons and pull them out of whatever trouble they've stumbled into. They usually hide in the fields behind me. May I suggest you prepare yourself mentally and physically. This will be your greatest trial yet, brave warrior. If you want me to find your sons, I'll need to know more about them. They're little sheets. Wondrous, beautiful, but shit's all the same. They won't listen to me, but perhaps they'll listen to you. You said your sons are likely in the field, but I'll need more to go on. They climb on everything. Buildings, towers, the crops, all the crops. They're exactly as tall as my sons, creating the perfect place for them to hide. <sighs> they never listen when I call for them. They'll listen to me. Don't worry. I'll make sure your sons come home safe. You must find all three of them. And hurry, there's only so long my wife will believe they're off praying at the temple. My sons, you brought them home! You were right. They are little shits. Mm. I can't believe they listen to you. Consider the trial of accurately finding my sons complete! Of all my victories, this is the one I'll be most remembered for. I have your Malakis tokens. No more games, no more schemes to rob me of my rat me. It's time to slay a Minotaur! Absolutely, Mistios. Uh, no problem. But first, perhaps you'd like to buy back your exquisite, uh, finely crafted trial tokens? This offer will expire in... Uh, by the gods! They uh, make for fantastic gifts. Not another rat me. Oh, but champion. Surely you want something to help you remember the Befka pre-trial? I... sorry, 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 sorry. And all that's left is facing our star attraction himself, the Minotaur! Are you ready to meet your doom? If your pre-trials are anything to go by, yes, yes I am. Well, good! Great! I... I... I want you to fight the Minotaur! You'll find the beast in the depths of the Cave of the Brave, on the Zithki Plateau. Two other warriors have just completed their pre-trials. You can speak to them for more information. They'll join you when you're ready to, you know, die horrifically. You've come all this way. Join us. <laughs> no, 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 no. I have a very important uh, pottery lesson to attend. So... <clears throat> and you must be the warriors. Look, brother! The final member of our Minotaur hunting party has arrived! When the beast sees our assembled might, he will moo miserably in fear! Do Minotaurs moo, or...? If it's all right with both of you, I'd like to strike the killing blow. Or can we at least say I struck the killing blow? I'm willing to haggle down to play the key role in distracting the Minotaur while allowing the killing blow to be struck. The Minotaur is a mythical creature. Only someone just as mythical could slay it. You're talking about me, right? The only myths about you, little brother, are the ones Pater paid to keep quiet. Ugh, this can only end well. Are you ready to ride? Let's slay a Minotaur. Leandro says it lives in the Cave of the Brave on the Victi Plateau. I say let the Minotaur tournament begin! Minotaur! <laughs>
What? Drop all your valuables and flee in terror. M mortal, leave me your drachme, and you shall be spared. Otherwise, death by hoof awaits you. Fear my move. Fear it? Malaka. I am going to start stabbing until someone tells me what's going on. Grrr. I said grrr. Oh, fuck it. Hi. There's no need for more blood. Just keep your horns away from me. And tell me what's going on here. You can take off that mask. Leandros? I told you nothing is what it seems in Fafka. I'm... I'm happy to refund any expenses incurred. Please. It's my daughter, uh, Amara. Masked men are holding her captive deep in the canyons of Titi Plateau. Masked men? What kind of masks? Uh, white like marble. Bleeding from their eyes. Horrific! The cult. They control everything in Pefka. Lured champions from all over with the promise of Minotaur slaying glory. Only to swindle and ambush them down here in the dark. Honorless. If I don't do as they say, uh, Amara dies. If I take off my mask, or tell my wife, or ask for help, she dies. Tell me about your daughter. Amara. The sound of her laughter is sunlight on my skin. She is joy, Mistios. One night, the masked men took that joy from me. They needed my silver tongue to lure wealthy warriors to their trials. In Amara, they found all they needed to control me. You said the cult, yeah, the masked men, have your daughter in the canyons of Dicti Plateau? There are a lot of canyons. But only one holds Amara. There is a place called Zakros, an ancient ruin, and the bastion of the masked men's power. I go there every night, hoping to catch a glimpse of her, but I never have. I, I fear they keep her underground, where she'll never see the sun. How many men have you sent to their deaths with a speech and a smile? Thousands. More. But their lives will never outweigh my Amara. She's all I have. But now I have you. Don't I? You. You can free her from those Malakas masked men. Tell me, whose face would Amara wish to see rescue her? Mine or her father's? Be brave, Leandros. Bravery, yes. You're right, Mistios. No matter what, I must be there for my Amara. Please, will you join me? We will save your daughter. Together. Thank you, Mistios. Meet me outside the ruins of Zakros on Vitki Plateau. That's where my daughter is and where I must be. These masked men, they're organized and unafraid. Their greatest weapon is no blade. It's our greed. Every merchant, every man in his slave earned enough rachni out of his charade to make Midas blush. The myth of the Minotaur makes us all rich, and we turn a blind eye to the cost. Gah! Why is this suit chafing? I used a whole bottle of olive oil. Hard to breathe in a costume this magnificent. By Zeus, this fair doesn't breathe at all. You are the Minotaur. You are the Minotaur. You are the Minotaur. You are the Minotaur. Oh, no, no, the last one was better. I'm coming, Amara. Don't be afraid. And don't you be afraid, Leandros. She needs you. You came. I was sure I'd fight alone. I'll stand with you, Leandros. No matter what happens today, Amara will be proud of her fun. I see you're still a Minotaur. I faced many of the Greek world's deadliest warriors in this mask. Granted, I was just there to distract those warriors with my roars and threatening gestures so they could be ambushed and stabbed from behind. But wearing it makes me feel brave. And you look it. It would be an honor to fight alongside the mythical Minotaur. Yes, yes! Moo! Don't do that. They must be keeping her underground. With hooves and heroics. We shall save her! But Zakros is well defended. How should we proceed? Quietly. I'll try to sneak in. Stay back here until it's safe. I can be stealthy. You have horns. <sighs> Good. 
go. I'll do my best to distract the guards. You saved me. Well? <gasps> Is that the Minotaur? Show her. Father? You're the Minotaur? Maybe don't tell your mother. I waited and waited and... You weren't going to leave me here, were you? You were just working on your plan to save me, right, Pater? Of course. I was always coming for you. I just... needed to find something first. The people who took you, if there's anything you overheard, anything that could help me stop them... While I pretended to sleep, their leader spoke at a meeting place in Kidonia. I wrote down all the masked men's whisperings. Hopefully something in here will be useful to you. My friend, we're heading to my wife. She keeps a vigil for Amar at the warrior's rest. Come with us. See the gift you gave. Our family, together. After you. Amara! Amara! You're alive! Mater! My family. You did this? Thank Leandros. When the time came for action, he charged, despite being outskilled and outcostumed. He fought courageously. Your husband is no coward. Perhaps there are some heroes here. No one's ever won the prize of Pefka! Everyone who's died facing the Minotaur has had their Drachni go in the vault, growing year by year. And now, a tiny but well-earned portion of it is yours! Thank you for a... a tiny portion? Of course! Less taxes, reasonable operational expenses, and I'll make sure all of it reaches your boat, Mistios. You've earned it. <laughs> oh, and... Hmm, this is for you. A coward doesn't deserve to be the Minotaur. You do. Quite the compliment. Pefka is no longer safe for us. Freeing Amara will bring repercussions from people who are not known to be forgiving. But we're alive, and whatever future we have, we have it only because of you. Be safe. Only the best warriors rest here. Heroes. They aren't many. But they're heroes of the arena. Those who earned an honorable death. The others are buried in unmarked holes far from here. Nobody remembers them. When your time comes, do you think you'll be worthy of the title hero, Mistyus? I'd be more than worthy to rest here. If someone proves strong enough to kill me. I've heard tales of you and your exploits, Mistyos. Impressive, if they're true. Depends on what you've heard. I've heard a lot. A warrior adventuring across the land. Sometimes they're half beast, or half god. But always an eagle bear. Tell me, is any of it true? They're all true. And there's more you don't know about. Good answer. I don't care if the stories are true. I can see you have it in you. A capacity for greatness. The potential to be... a real hero. I am Mayo. Alexios. If you want to truly live, Alexios, to become a hero of the arena, and to win riches beyond your wildest dreams, you need to fight in Sounds interesting. Good. Take my boat and head up the Pefka coast towards the shipwreck and into the mouth of the valley. There, you'll find the entrance to my arena and Skura, who handles my fighters. If he sees what I see in you, I think he'll have much to be excited about. Shh. Do you hear that? I hear nothing but the wind. Exactly. Nothing. Right. They tell me you could hear the crowds from all the way out here. The thirst never quenched. Thirst? For what? Combat in the arena, Mistyos. Life and death in their purest forms. Love, hate, glory and ruin. All there for the crowds to devour. My name is Skura. 
Alexios, I found a note that mentioned this place, and you. It called for fighters from all over the Greek world. These walls no longer shake because there are no heroes of the arena left. The crowds don't care about real fighters anymore. They just want blood. But you, Mystios, you could change that. You could make them care. And win riches beyond your wildest dreams, of course. If you were to fight and win. Perhaps I can make the arena walls shake once again. Good. Tell me about the other fighters. As a new contender, the choice of opponent will be yours. No slaves here. No hapless criminals. Just warriors with a resolve to spill blood for the crowd. I see. There are five current champions. Each one more bloodthirsty and ruthless than the last. You'll need to defeat each of them if you are to be called hero of the arena. Tell me more about the arena. It's been here for decades, but recently it's changed. As most things do. True. Fighters today care only about Drachmi, not honor. And the crowds now come only to watch one warrior get another. They're jaded. They want more than just killing. They want cruelty. My blades and I are ready. Choose your opponent. I'll fight this king of the bandits. I will take your life, Mistios! have done well in there. Did you not see? I haven't seen a fight from inside the arena in years. But if the crowds are cheering like that, perhaps I have a hero in my hands after all. Of course they cheer for me. Who could resist cheering for a warrior legend in the arena? Maybe the stories I've heard are true. Skura. Aeon. Ah, Mistyos. I knew it as soon as I laid eyes on you. You could be could be hero of the arena like Skura. If you keep fighting, I foresee a long and profitable career for both of us. Talk to Skura when you're ready to continue. Choose your opponent. I will spear Velos like a wild animal. I'll have your guts! Yeah! 
Dmistheus. The spear. It reminds me of long ago. Of the Persians. This spear has killed many Persians. As have I. On the battlefield and in the arena. You fought in the Persian Wars? I did. What was that like? Hard. The Persians were a formidable enemy. They had the numbers. They had warriors from a tall conquered lands in their armies. It took a united Greek war to turn them back. Anything less would have been total defeat. A united Greek world? Seems like fantasy now. Agreed. But coming back from the war was harder than the war itself. Maon and I found daily life afterwards to be... difficult. We had been men filled with life and death purpose. We found that again in the arena. What was the arena like in your time? It was a place of honor and heroism. I bathed my blade in blood for years. But that was a different time, and I was a different man. How exactly did you become hero of the arena? What did you do? I survived. I have to go. You've done a warrior's job in the arena. Keep it up. Thank you. Back! Stay back! I'll jump! You don't have to do this. There's always something to live for. No, not for me. I've got nothing. I am nothing. This isn't even armor. It's my mother's third favorite serving tray. I'm a failure. A failure! Stop wasting everybody's time and come back from the edge. If you were going to jump, you'd have done it by now. What? I will. Any second now. No, you won't. You're a coward. I'm no coward. I'll show you. <sighs> My Zeus is tunic, you're right. Of course you're right. I am a coward. Come away from the edge. Talk to me. <sighs> My village. <laughs> We're poor. We get little trade. Fewer visitors. We're dying. I was chosen to kill the Minotaur, hoping it would make us famous. Put us on the map. Save us, baby. But look at me. I'm no Minotaur slayer. I got robbed by a tiny tour guide my first day here. Minotaur slaying isn't for everyone. Even if you go home without the beast's head, there will be another way to save your village. Yes, you're right. All I have to do is lie to everyone. Do not put words in my mouth. Why not? They're good words. My people are kind and loving and somewhat dim. Really? Hard to believe. I just have to make them think I've killed the Minotaur. Our village will become a shrine to me. The new Theseus. Mori is the Magnificent. Slayer of the Minotaur. We would prosper again. Sounds like a dream. A dream where people care about my village. Trade with it. That's a dream worth having. A little look convincing. Like a regal. Conquering Minotaur killing hero. Best steal the Pefka leader's shiniest armor. Oh, and I need a weapon. Something I can say I pride from the Minotaur's cold dead hands. <laughs> cold dead hoofs? Don't worry. I'm here to help. Good. 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 Is there anything else I can tell you? An ox that looks like you've looted it from the corpse of a Minotaur. Is there a merchant for that in Pefka? When I first arrived... I heard rumors of a legendary axe being kept in Fort Lato. That's where you'll find what I need. What's so special about this axe? They say Theseus touched it. Twice! I'm sure Theseus handled many axes in his time. Well, yes. But he touched this one twice. Now that's the sort of axe you'd expect a Minotaur to wield. You mentioned the shiniest armor was the Pafkan leaders. Where does he keep it? Somewhere safe. Somewhere where little street kids couldn't steal it. His house is well guarded. I'd look there. I've heard enough. 
I'll find you an axe and armor worthy of a true Minotaur Slayer. Just don't... jump. I wouldn't think of it. I'm back, and I have everything you need to successfully lie to your people. Oh, fantastic! And fear not, friend. This is a lie that will save my people. It will put us back on the map. Well... Can I, uh... Can I have my items now, please? Of course. The axe and the armor are yours. Just uh, turn around for a second while I change. Oh, you look heroic. Like a warrior who could kill a whole family of minotaurs. Really? You're not just saying that. I mean it. Even I'm a bit intimidated by you now. Wow. It's okay, guys. I'm a hero now. I'm coming down. 